We had a website up and running, but it was very staid and a static one. Um, and we needed to refresh it to make it more uh, up to date. We were lucky enough to, um, through Craig, the, the Wales Co-op, um, to have a, a, somebody who had the knowledge to take our old website off, which was a, a hard job in, 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 in its own. And then Craig created a new website for us. Um, and we are at the moment now trying to learn how to update it and uh, get the knowledge. The website is nice and fresh, um, but we're hoping that we'll get a lot of hits. And it's up to us now to, to keep it up to date. And uh, we're hoping that the extra languages, as people put searches into it, the, uh, our website will be flagged up by other nationalities. Because we are a port and we have a lot of passengers going through the port with spare time, we're hoping that our website will be flagged up and people will be drawn into the museum. At the moment we're hoping to put on um, all our maritime books and books on the history of Holyhead and North Wales, uh, shipwrecks around the North Wales, Wales coast, uh, postcards, we sell pro pro collectors postcards and they would go on the website as well. Um, and Souvenirs, mm -hmm. perhaps the fridge magnets of all the local, uh, local scenic places. We've had a, a couple of other sites interested in putting their links to our site because they realise that uh, as a well-established um, facility in the town, they realise that do people do visit our site and uh, other people have sort of said they want to be linked to our site, you know. Um, yeah, so I mean, the potential for, for the site to develop and become quite an important site in the town, yeah. it, it, the potential to be recognised.